Hi, I'm Ronnie Smith. I'm Susanna Love, and together we run Ronnie Smith Kennels in Pahuska, Oklahoma. Our family has trained dogs for nearly a century, and along the way we have learned a thing or two. Here are some simple methods to make life with you and your dog more enjoyable. Achieving a well-trained dog doesn't have to take hours and hours of repetition every day. You can break it down into short little workouts and you can incorporate it into your everyday life. Other than the weekends, um, through the weekday, the only time that you have to work with your dog is, especially in the winter, that the last hour of daylight. So uh, you're better off to do a lot of short reps, repetitions, rather than one long duration. If you'll just peck away just little building blocks to the desired behavior that you want, um, you're going to be a lot more successful with your dog. So some of the things to keep in mind when you're setting up your workout, have a goal in mind. Okay, what are we gonna go work on today? Okay, we're gonna work on sit, or we're gonna work on healing, whatever that is that you wanna focus on. And keep it simple, always break it down into small increments for your dog. And a workout may be as short as 10, 12, 15 minutes. What we like to do at our kennel is we like to always end on a positive note. Get a little something done and then let your dog go have some free time and end on that positive note where, hey, that was fun. And even like right here, Suzanne and I are talking and we're working with uh, Mocha. Mocha's the dog that wants to kite off and has a very, very short attention span. So as we're talking, I am very aware of the fact that if she moves, I'm going to make a correction. It's that type of consistency and dedication um, that will lead to a really finished and polished dog. Even if it's walking out of the door, not letting your dog rush ahead of you. When I ask her to sit, um, it doesn't mean sit for 30 seconds and then I forget about you and you can kite off. She cannot move until I, I tell her or allow her to move. Your dog is not just learning in the 15 minute workout that you have designated as your dog training session. That dog is learning throughout the day. So like Ronnie and I standing here talking, we're still aware of our dog. We still have to pay attention to our dog because we've asked them to do something. So we still have to keep those rules consistent even throughout our day.